nothing new here. Amen. Amen. But we're going to give you something that came up in prayer yes, as we were meditating and preparing for this opportunity. Amen. If you would go with me to 1 Samuel chapter 17, and we're going to begin looking at verse number 32. When you have it, say, I am there. I am there. And the word of the Lord reads thusly, And David said to Saul, Let no man's heart fail because of him. Mm. Thy servant will go and fight with this Philistine. And David, or Saul said to David, Thou art not able to go against this Philistine to fight with him, for thou art but a youth, and he a man of war from his youth. And David said unto Saul, Thy servant kept his father's sheep. And there came a lion and a bear, and took a lamb out of the flock. I went out after him and smote him and delivered it out of his mouth. And when he arose against me, I caught him by his beard and smote him and slew him. Thy servant slew both the lion and the bear. And this uncircumcised Philistine shall be as one of them, seeing he hath defied the armies of the living God. Can you bow your heads with us as we pray? Father... In Jesus' name, we thank you for this opportunity. We thank you for your presence. We thank you for your power. We thank you for your anointing that's already in the room. We thank you, God, for the power of the worship that went forth. Now, God, I ask in Jesus' name that you would speak a word to every believer that is hearing what the Spirit is saying to the church. I trust you this day that you will manifest your glory in Jesus' name. And we all said together, amen. Let us 